Synchronized cardioversion and defibrillation are two different procedures used to treat abnormal heart rhythms, but they differ in their purpose and how the electrical shock is delivered. Synchronized cardioversion is used when a patient has an extremely fast, irregular, or unstable heart rhythm but still has a pulse. The procedure delivers a controlled electrical shock that is timed to match a specific part of the heart's electrical cycle. Synchronized cardioversion prevents the R on T phenomenon by delivering the electrical shock at the peak of the R wave, avoiding the vulnerable period during the T wave, which reduces the risk of causing a more dangerous rhythm such as ventricular fibrillation. Because the shock is carefully timed and usually less intense, patients often receive sedation to make the procedure more comfortable. Defibrillation, on the other hand, is used in emergency situations when a patient's heart rhythm is chaotic and there is no pulse. The electrical shock in defibrillation is delivered immediately and without synchronization to the heart's electrical cycle. The goal is to stop the disorganized electrical activity and allow the heart to reset to a normal rhythm. This shock is usually stronger than the one used in synchronized cardioversion and is performed quickly without sedation due to the urgency of the situation. In summary, synchronized cardioversion is a planned, lower-energy shock delivered in sync with the heartbeat for patients who still have a pulse, while defibrillation is an urgent, higher-energy shock delivered without timing for patients in cardiac arrest. Both aim to restore a normal heart rhythm but are used in different clinical contexts with different methods.